Hi, I'm Phil from Her Stamp Studios and thank you for tuning in again today. We're going to be doing section two of our Samba. So again, if you've not done section one, if you flick back on our YouTube channel, it's up there ready for you to watch and learn the basics. So in the last video, section one, we did our four reverse basics, which is four of those. And then we did four whisks, one and four of those. Okay, I'm now gonna move on to Samba Walks. Now these are really, really unusual. I'll show you how they should be done, and then I'll show you how you will end up doing them as many, many other people do at home. Because again, we're not entering a dance competition anytime soon. These videos are purely for fun. Okay, so we finished the last section. I'll do this lead first. We did our four whisks and four bum bum. Now instead of starting again, we're gonna turn our body now to promenade position. Promenade position basically means we're both going the same way. So instead of us going forward and our lady going back, we're now both gonna go forwards. And that's promenade. But that will make sense when I dance with Isabella shortly. So after our fourth whisk, four behind. We're then gonna to turn to promenade and we're gonna do left push pull, right push pull, and left push pull. We're just gonna do three of those. I'll show you that again. So from whisk number four, when we finished our last section, we're gonna dance. Left push pull, right push pull, left push pull. Now they are very, very tricky steps, the samba walk. A lot of people simply dance them as a step, rock, rock, step, rock, rock, step, rock, rock, which is absolutely fine. Remember, these online videos are great for learning a little bit at home and the idea is purely to give you a bit of inspiration to go and join a dance class. Online videos are in no way a substitute for joining a dance class. They simply are not because I can't tell you at home what you're doing wrong because I can't see you. So these are purely just for a bit of fun and to inspire you to go and join a dance class when you're up and ready. Okay, from there, we've done our three samba walks. Again, I'm doing this as the lead. We've done one, two, and three. From there, we're gonna to dance to what's called a volta. So a volta is a really unusual step. It's two little steps. We go up, cross, up, cross, up, cross. I'll turn around and I'll show you from this way. So again, it goes side, and you, you rise up on that side step, side, you cross and drop, side cross and drop, side cross and drop, side cross and drop. So it's almost as though you've got a really dodgy ankle and you're sort of limping along if you think of it like that. So your left foot for gents as we're going to dance now, you never lower your heel. So we're going to keep our heel off the floor, up, we're going to drop as we cross, up, drop, up, drop, up, drop. Okay. I'll show you that little section in its entirety. So three samba walks. Step, push, pull. Step, rock, rock, step. Now we've altered. Cross, two, and three, and four. I'll show you from the other way around. So again, three samba walks. Step, push, pull. Step, push, pull. Step, push, pull. One, and two, and three, and four. And that's the end. From there, we simply step forward, left foot, and we start again. Okay, ladies, exactly the same technique as I just mentioned there for the gents, but I'll do it on the correct footing for you. So we're gonna step after our fourth whisk with our right foot first into our samba walks. And it goes, step, push, pull, left, push, pull, and right, push, pull. Now ladies, you're gonna cross in front with your left foot. Cross and two and three and four. And then to start again, straight back on your right. Okay, I'll do it again this way. So again, this is from the lady's perspective. Right foot first into your samba walks and it goes. Right push, pull, left push, pull, right push, pull, left foot in front, cross and two and three and four, right foot back and we start again, one and uh, two. Okay, I will show you that now with my fabulous assistant, Isabella. Righty ho. So we will do just this new section, then we'll join it all together for you. So we'll do it from both ways around. So ladies, you can see from this perspective, we're gonna do the three samba walks first, which goes step, push, pull, or step, rock, rock, step, then we've altered one and two and three and four. 
Okay, we'll do it straight at this time. I'll do it from each angle so you get a good perspective from home. So again, from our last whisk, we're gonna step in promenade, both going forwards. Step, push, pull. Step, push, pull. Step, now we volta. Volta, back to face each other. Start again, okay? This time we will turn this way around. Maybe just a knock, we haven't. Okay, so again, three samba walks, we do. Forward, push, pull. Forward, push, pull. Forward, then we volta. Volta, two, and start again. Okay, I'll dance that through from the beginning of section one, that hopefully you've learned by now, uh, and then we'll do it in its entirety to music. Right, okay. So we've got four basics. One, ah, uh, two, two, ah, uh, two, three, ah, uh, two, and the four, then to the side. One, B, high, two, three. Now a samba walk, it goes. One, push, pull, two, push, pull, three, then we volta. Vault to two, R three, R four, and from there start again, left foot forward and ladies right foot back. Right, we'll dance that through to music for you a couple of times, turning um, so you get it from different angles. Let's have a go. Okay, I hope you enjoyed that section two of our samba. Again, these are purely for a little bit of fun at home and hopefully to get you inspired to go join a dance class. If we don't see you in one of our classes, if you live outside the area, then hopefully we'll see you in one of our Blackpool Tower dances or one of our dance weekends or social dances. Happy dancing, everybody, and stay safe. <laughs>